Hey guys, welcome to Safi Mixed. In this video, I will guide you how to change the settings of Start Menu. And I would like to begin from the Personalize. Right click on your desktop and come down to Personalize. In this window, opens up. Here on the left menu, click on the Start. And these uh, settings are available to be uh, managed. Uh, you can show more tiles on the start. You can toggle this on or toggle this off. If you toggle this on, it will show too many uh, tiles, live tiles on the start menu. So I keep this always on the off position. So app list in the start menu. So I keep this on because I want the app list to be on. Similarly, show recently added apps. Uh, I keep this on because sometimes I use uh, recently added apps frequently, and th that's why I use this. I keep this on the, on the on position. So most use apps, you can uh, toggle this up and toggle this on, but keep this toggle on that you can easily access the apps that you are frequently using. And uh, there are other settings. You can go through them for your choice. And now let me move to another things. Uh, hit the Windows button on your keyboard to open the uh, Start menu. And here, these are the apps list, the most recent used apps list, which we saw there in the previous video. If uh, had I toggled that off, this list would have gone uh, off, but I keep this list on. That's why I didn't toggle that off. And now uh, on the right side, the, these are called live, live tiles. You can uh, move the position from uh, by double clicking and dragging. You can adjust them anywhere. You can change them uh, wherever you want. So these are not static. You can change the position by double clicking and then dragging. Uh, you can add other apps to uh, this list from the uh, these menu, for example, if I double click on WhatsApp and I drag it over here, I can add its shortcuts to uh, the uh, live tiles. I can add the shortcuts of any other program from this list. For example, if I want to add this Chromium, I can add this over here. Okay, you can uh, put the shortcuts of any app to this list, to the live tiles. Uh, and similarly, you can uh, unpin them from here. For example, if I want to remove this, I just right click on it and I click on the unpin and it would directly be removed. Similarly, I remove this one, I unpin this, and that's what I can do with these tiles. You can do one more thing with these tiles. You can change the size of these tiles and that you can do by right clicking on any tile, on any pin, and here come to resize in these options are available small medium wide large if i click on small it would convert the size to small uh, thumbnail and similarly if i uh, put this on another wide I, it will go like this this is now wide you see so i keep them on medium usually uh, all of them on medium and i can resize them over here Okay, uh, that's what you can do with this tile. You can add other tiles. You can remove any one of them and you can change the size of these tiles. You can change the background color of the start menu and that you can do again by going to personalize and uh, being on personalized window. Come to colors. And uh, here are different colors. For example, if I want to change the color to this one, mint dark. I click on main dark so it is now ticked and if I come back to start menu now the color of the start menu is accordingly changed so you can change the background color of the um, start menu as well now if you right click on the uh, setting here and click on personalize this list you will come to this window and here choose which folders appear and start and these are the different folders you see 
uh, settings folder, documents folder, they are set on on in downloads. So if you want to keep the downloads folder on your start menu, you can turn this on, but I don't want that. Similarly, you can add the music folder to the start menu and you can switch this off. This, this is the picture folder, videos folder, network folder, personalized folder, personal folders. So you can uh, even change these settings. The, the settings are different folders that you want to add your your start menu. Also, in the personalized uh, window and being on start menu, if you switch on your start full screen, let me switch this on. And now I minimize this and I again open the start menu. So the start menu will uh, engage the whole desktop but I don't want there, so that's why I want to switch this off. I'm not interested in a full screen. And now if I go back to, it will be on the uh, corner part of the desktop. So this way you can uh, change the settings of start menu on your laptop. In the end, if you haven't just subscribed to Safi Mix, kindly support the channel by pressing the subscribe button and hit the like button on the video. Thanks for watching.